Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I thought it would be a lot of fun to do a voiceover tutorial for this gorgeous green duochrome eye look and also I had the flu when I filmed this so I literally had no voice. First I am starting off by priming my eyes using the Bare Minerals 5-in-1 Advanced Performance BB Cream Eyeshadow. This one is in the shade Barely Nude and I just apply it straight to my eyelids and then I blend it out with my fingers. Next, I'm going in with the shade Dainty from the Too Faced Pretty Rebels palette and using this to set the primer. And now I'm taking the shade Ringleader, also from the Too Faced Pretty Rebels palette, and then I'm going to use that to start building up the crease colors. Now I'm going in with the shade Puree from the Too Faced Sweet Peach palette, and I'm placing this in my crease to start deepening it up, and then I'm taking the shade Bless Her Heart, and that is going all over my eyelid and this is kind of a shimmery green that will help ease the transition from the green duochrome shadow that I'm going to place all over my eyelid and the brown warm tone crease colors. And then as you can see here, I'm blending it out and then taking the shade Girly from the Pretty Rebel palette and this is the gorgeous green duochrome. It's got kind of shimmery green and then brown reflex in it and then I'm just going to blend that out really well. Now going on with this dark shade Tempting, I'm placing that on the outer V of my eye and I'm going to blend it out super well just to create a little bit of definition. Moving on to my face, I'm priming with the Cover FX Mattifying Primer and I'm just kind of ignoring all of the fallout that's on my face because there's a lot. I'm taking the Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation in the shade 112 and blending that all over my face with my Beauty Blender. And then I'm taking the Boo Boo Cover Up Concealer and I'm placing that on any little acne spot and then blending that out as well. To highlight and conceal the rest of my face, I'm taking the Maybelline Master Conceal in the shade Pen Fair and I'm blending that under my eyes really well to cover up my dark circles. And I'm also using that to clean up the edge of my shadow because I left it really messy and I want it to look a bit more clean. This is the Basame Vanilla Powder and I am using that under my eyes to set the concealer and to help brighten up my under eyes. And then I'm taking my Bare Minerals Mineral Veil on the rest of my face just to set that foundation. For brows, I'm taking the Inspir Duo Brow Powder in the shade Dark Brown and using the darkest shade, I'm filling in my brows just a little bit here. And then I'm taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel to set the brows and make sure they don't move all day. I'm going to do my under eyes now using that shade Ringleader and going all the way across my lower lash line to help blend the colors together. And then Bless Her Heart is going right along my lower lash line as well and connecting up to the top. And then Tempting is going just on the outer third again for a little bit of definition. I'm using the Stila Stingray Liner to line my eyes and then I'm going to pop on a pair of false lashes. These are Ardell Demi Wispies and I'm just placing these on very, very, very carefully. I'm going to use the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara to blend the falsies with my natural lashes. I am taking the NYX Highlight and Contour Pro Palette and using this cooler toned brown to bronze up my face a little and then I'm going to go in and contour with this darker brown shade and it's a little bit warmer so I can just get an edgier look. Now I'm taking Lucky Clover. This is from the Moonchild Glow Kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills and highlighting. For the blush, I'm taking this gorgeous peachy shade from the Too Faced Sweet Peach Glow and popping that onto my cheeks and then I'm going to place a little bit of that Lucky Clover shade on the inner corners of my eyes. For lips, I am taking the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lippy in the shade Times Square. And this is kind of just a warm, neutral shade. I think it goes really well with the brown tones in the eye look. So this is the final finished makeup look. I had a lot of fun doing it and a lot of fun doing this voiceover for you guys. I think it is a gorgeous glam look and I love the duochrome eyeshadow. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like this look, please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Ilea. Check out my latest video and subscribe. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and have a wonderful day.